this is Victor from BR Speed Shop. Get ready. We're going to be building a rocket stove. Stay tuned. Thanks. We'll see you. Okay, so that's 45 degree angle right there. That's right there. That. So what does that get me? That's a five. That point? That's a five. That's what, a five from, five. Come from this side. Okay. From there to there. All right. Hook it on the other end. Makes it easier. What? Hook it like this. Okay. What do we got? Solid stuff. We got a suck. We got a. We got about a, a 17. 16. Right there. What? Oh. Okay. 16. Okay. Pretty close to 16. I'm tracked on! I'm gonna go across like these. It's like. It's about a four. That's, that's an eight. No, five. It's about a four. Then we'll do another 45. Alright. Alright, alright. Alright, mate. Candy. Okay, getting ready to get ready to tack it up. Huh? Got some tig rod. What? <laughs> what a daisy. Huh? She's ready to play. Huh? She's ready to play, huh, what? Daisy? What? Okay. I didn't hear you. All right. Wait, are we done? We're done? Oh, we're not. Uh, I usually go with about ah. 10 to 20 uh, airflow PSI. No use in wasting extra gas. I'll probably go up just a little bit on that. Okay, go ahead. No, no, no. Don't do it. Don't look. Wait, man. spot where it's not as difficult. All right. I'm gonna try to just fuse and tack it. And I need to get about four button tacks on it before I can start welding this portion. We will get you on the 
this thing. Oh, yeah. I gotta get tech though. when we, we dunked it a little bit this touched this touched into the metal when you do that it gets it contaminated see the black the black soot right here so but it looks pretty good it's nice real nice right there see how nice and smooth it is it's a little jerky a little bit there but we don't touch real hot pretty cool Yeah, pretty cool, but what do you think? Got welding. It's a good one to learn how to do. You can make all kinds of stuff. You can make bicycles, you can make go cars, you can make you know, whatever you can think of in metal. When you're first learning TIG welding is the lay wire technique where you just basically lay the wire in front and then you put a little bit of pressure on the rod and then you just you just let it melt and move forward let it melt move forward let it melt move forward let it melt move forward and you just kind of keep doing that another good thing too is like right here my cup is resting up against on the uh, on the tubing and you just kind of rest it there and then you just drag, hold it, let it melt, drag, hold it, let it melt. I mean, when you get better, you can you can do the feed technique where you feed feed the wire with your your hand, your left hand. But if not, you can just dab it, dab it, dab it, or you can do the lay wire where you just leave it and you drag.
<laughs> Gear you got going on there, bud. Got a thief in the midst. <laughs> Give me all your money. That's what I say. I think that turned out pretty sweet. Isn't that the game be the grill? It's the grill, bro. On the grill, bro. Grill B. This is going way faster than I thought. Is it? Yeah. Because you haven't even been out here the whole time. <laughs> That's why it's going by so much faster. Give me all your money. <laughs> Give, me all your Give me all your money, clown. No. no. <laughs> Don't be a thief now. <laughs> this yeah. is a Carhartt brand. Carhartt brand robbery yeah. set up. <laughs> Give me all your money, punk! <laughs> <laughs> I'm B! <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> Don't talk to me until I've had my soup. Oh yeah, time to get some <laughs> fabrication done today! Ah. Woo! Alright. I'm not forcing now around. It's all warm and we're not just. Now it's all we're sweaty. not just joking around here. Yeah, we're not just joking yeah. around. Give me all your money. Turn all the joking around. No, love joking around.
me and Daisy are out here working on uh, finishing the rocket stove. She's my biggest helper. Hi, huh, Daisy. You a big helper? You a big helper? Yeah, you're a big helper, huh? Motivational, Daisy. You're a motivational, Daisy. Yes, yes, you are. So anyway, here's where we're at on the. Uh, <laughs> here's where we're at on the build. We have. See, she can't. She needs. She needs me to. <laughs> you big hog, stop it! It's not all about you, Daisy. It's not all about you, Daisy. It's not. It's not about you. Okay. Anyway, um, got the rocket stove. Um, got the base built. Got the um, transition where it goes from square tube to the grill. Um, everything's stainless. So I've seen some other rocket stoves. They're all a little different, you know, it depends on what, what you're looking for. But uh, this one, it's kind of first stage right now. So I'm gonna put some legs on it. Um, I'm gonna tack the top on, the transition. I'm gonna tack that on to the tube. And then I'm gonna tack the grate on. And I don't know if that's gonna stay like that, but it's basically so I can get a get a fire going. And you know, I probably won't tack the grate on actually, because I wanna be able to open it up and maybe put wood in from the inside as well. I don't know yet. And I might also add a um, another air inlet, because right now it's coming down through or it has the holes in the bottom, which it could pull through. But I'm thinking that I maybe you're gonna put a, um, a plate on the bottom that catches the ashes and like slides out or something. And then on the back side, I'm probably gonna put maybe an auxiliary air inlet, depending on how it works. I wanna, I'm gonna put it together and I'm gonna test it. So that's my plan for this video. And if I want to, I maybe put some hinges on the on the grill part so I can open it up. Uh, maybe I'll make it to where this transition piece slides off. Maybe put a sleeve on it. Right now I'm just going to tack it. I'm going to see how the you know how the fire works inside of it because I go and I weld everything together and I'm like, well, it's not even getting hot enough to grill a hot dog up there. That's not going to work for me. Is we got the rocket stove version 1.0. What do you think? Well. I'm gonna have to taste my hot dog to see how it feels. Feels right. Yeah, yeah roll those ones over to the middle. Are you doing it right? Huh? Are you doing it right? I guess so. That's good. He'll be fine. Alright. <laughs> see ya. Have a good day. Besides, I haven't been cooked already. Chick, chick, pow. Chick, chicky, chicken, pow. Ooh, I want to try one. Come over. Tell me how this thing works. Okay. Tell me how my uh, rocket stove grill works. Hot? Let's see. 